Have you ever wondered about the top 10 places to visit in Holland? Let's delve into this land of tulips and windmills, a country brimming with rich history, diverse culture, and picturesque landscapes. From towering cathedrals to charming towns, Holland is a treasure trove of experiences waiting to be discovered. It's not just a destination, but a journey into a world that's beautifully different, yet warmly familiar. So buckle up, culture explorers, as we embark on a virtual journey to the top 10 must-visit places in Holland. Kicking off our countdown, at number 10, we have the Windmills of Kinderdijk. Nestled in the heart of the Netherlands, these windmills are a testament to Dutch ingenuity and resilience. They stand tall, not just as tourist attractions, but as symbols of Holland's historical battle against water. The windmills of Kinderdijk are a unique spectacle of 19 ancient windmills, built around the mid-18th century. They were constructed to keep the land from flooding, demonstrating an early form of Dutch water management. But these windmills aren't just functional, they're also a sight to behold. With their traditional architecture and picturesque setting, they offer a charming glimpse into Holland's past. Their significance extends beyond the borders of the Netherlands too. Recognized for their importance and uniqueness, the windmills of Kinderdijk have earned a spot on the UNESCO World Heritage List. A visit to Holland would be incomplete without a trip to these iconic windmills. Coming in at number 9 we have the city of Utrecht, a vibrant city pulsating with life. Utrecht is steeped in rich history and is a treasure trove of stunning architecture. The city's crown jewel is undoubtedly the Dom Tower, a soaring structure that stands as a testament to Utrecht's medieval past. Walking through Utrecht is like stepping back in time, with the city's historic charm beautifully preserved in its cobblestone streets and centuries-old buildings. Yet Utrecht is anything but dated. The city is buzzing with a youthful energy thanks to its bustling cafes, hip boutiques, and vibrant arts scene. One cannot talk about Utrecht without mentioning its charming canals. These waterways crisscrossing the city add a unique character to Utrecht, their tranquil waters reflecting the city's picturesque skyline. Indeed, Utrecht is a city that perfectly encapsulates the charm of Holland. Bursting with history, alive with culture, and brimming with stunning sights, Utrecht is a must-visit for anyone looking to experience the true essence of Holland. At number 8, we have the Kuykenhof Gardens. A sublime spectacle of nature, Kuykenhof Gardens is famously known as the Garden of Europe. This enchanting garden nestled in the heart of Holland boasts an awe-inspiring display of floral beauty. Each spring, the gardens come alive in a riot of colors, as millions of tulips burst into bloom. From the deepest reds to the most vibrant yellows and the softest pinks, it's like walking through a living rainbow. Each tulip, unique in its shape and hue, contributes to this kaleidoscopic canvas of nature. It's not just tulips, though. The Kuykenhof Gardens also play host to a variety of other flowers such as daffodils, hyacinths, and orchids, each adding to the garden's charm. This floral paradise, with its intoxicating fragrances and stunning vistas, is a feast for all senses. Kuykenhof Gardens is a paradise for nature lovers. At number 7, we have the Rijksmuseum. This monumental museum in Amsterdam is a treasure trove of art and history, spanning from the Middle Ages to the present day. Its extensive collection is home to over one million objects, each one telling a unique story. Among these countless pieces, the works of famous Dutch artists stand out. Rembrandt's The Night Watch is a prime example, a masterpiece that brings the Dutch Golden Age to life with its intricate details and dramatic use of light and shadow. Johannes Vermeer's The Milkmaid, another highlight, mesmerizes with its serene simplicity and striking realism. But it's not just about the art. The Rijksmuseum itself is a work of art, a stunning example of Dutch Gothic and Renaissance architecture, which adds another layer to your visit. Whether you're a seasoned art lover or just starting to explore, the Rijksmuseum offers a journey through time and culture. Art enthusiasts will find a visit to the Rijksmuseum an enriching experience. Coming in at number 6, we have the city of Maastricht. This city is a treasure trove of historical gems, from its Roman ruins to medieval fortifications. Maastricht's architecture is a visual feast, with ornate churches, grand squares, and cobblestone streets that tell tales of the city's rich past. A walk through the city reveals a vibrant culture. Maastricht's bustling squares are filled with locals and tourists alike enjoying the lively atmosphere of cafes, boutiques, and galleries. The city's gastronomy scene is a food lover's paradise, boasting a combination of traditional Dutch fare 
and innovative culinary creations. Maastricht is also known for its famous Christmas market. As the year draws to a close, the city transforms into a winter wonderland, with twinkling lights, festive stalls, and the scent of mulled wine and gingerbread filling the air. Maastricht is a city that offers a unique blend of history and modernity. At number 5 we have the Van Gogh Museum. This is not just a museum, it's an immersive journey into the life of one of the world's most fascinating artists, Vincent Van Gogh. Located in Amsterdam, the museum houses the largest collection of Van Gogh's works in the world. More than 200 paintings, 500 drawings, and 700 of his letters are on display. The museum offers a unique opportunity to delve into the life and works of Van Gogh. From his early works that reflect the hardship of rural life to his later more abstract and colorful pieces. Every phase of Van Gogh's artistic journey is meticulously documented. The museum also sheds light on the artist's mental health struggles, offering a poignant understanding of the man behind the art. Whether you're an art aficionado or a casual observer, the allure of Van Gogh's masterpieces is irresistible. The Van Gogh Museum is a must-visit for art lovers. Coming in at number 4 we have the City of Rotterdam. A dazzling display of contemporary design, Rotterdam's skyline is an architectural marvel. The city is renowned for its cutting-edge buildings, each one a testament to the bold vision of its creators. Nightlife in Rotterdam is as vibrant as its architecture. The city pulses with energy once the sun goes down, offering an array of experiences for every taste. From intimate jazz clubs to bustling night markets, there's never a dull moment in this city after dark. And then, there's the famous Erasmus Bridge, a soaring structure that has become an iconic symbol of Rotterdam. With its graceful lines and impressive span, the bridge is a sight to behold, particularly when illuminated at night. But Rotterdam isn't just about modern designs and lively evenings, it also boasts a rich maritime history, with the stunning port serving as a constant reminder of the city's seafaring roots. Rotterdam is a city that embodies the spirit of modern Holland. At number 3 we have the Anne Frank House. This isn't just a house, it's a symbol of resilience and an emblem of human spirit. Nestled in the heart of Amsterdam, the Anne Frank House is a poignant journey into the past, chronicling the two-year hiding of Anne Frank and her family during the Second World War. The house, now a museum, is where Anne penned her world-renowned diary. Her words, filled with hope and dreams, echo through the rooms, painting a stark contrast to the grim reality of war. The secret annex, the hinged bookcase, her room, each corner tells a story, each wall bears witness to the horrors of the Holocaust. The Anne Frank House is not just a destination, it's an experience, a walk through history, a testament to the power of a young girl's spirit. It's a place that leaves you with a profound sense of respect and contemplation. The Anne Frank House is a sobering reminder of the horrors of war. Coming in at number two, we have the Canals of Amsterdam. This beautiful city is a labyrinth of waterways, a real-life watercolor painting that captures the heart of every visitor. Amsterdam's canals are not just pretty to look at, but form an integral part of the city's landscape, shaping its identity and rhythm. You haven't truly seen Amsterdam until you've embarked on a canal cruise. As you gently glide through the serene waterways, you'll find yourself marveling at the stunning architecture of the canal houses, each one unique and filled with history. You see, these houses are more than just bricks and mortar, they're a testament to Amsterdam's rich past. These canals with their charming houseboats and iconic bridges offer a unique perspective of the city. As day turns into night, the canals transform into a magical spectacle of shimmering reflections, a sight to behold. The canals of Amsterdam offer a unique and charming perspective of the city. And finally, at number one, we have the Royal Palace of Amsterdam. This impressive edifice standing in the heart of the city is a symbol of both grandeur and historical significance. Originally built as a city hall in the 17th century, it later became the royal residence and today it serves as the king's abode when he is in town. The architecture of this palace is a sight to behold, demonstrating the exquisite craftsmanship of the Dutch Golden Age. Its stunning facade, intricate interiors and timeless elegance are a testament to the artistic genius of architect Jacob van Kampen. But the royal palace is more than just a beautiful building, it plays a significant role in state visits and royal events, serving as a backdrop for various important occasions.
From lavish banquets to royal weddings, the palace has seen it all, making it a living piece of Dutch history. The Royal Palace of Amsterdam is a symbol of Holland's rich history and royal heritage.